and welcome to Simply Yours, the show where I make Kaz videos, speed builds, and I might do gameplay if you guys want to see that. You gotta let me know if you do. I'm notorious for cheating in this game, so if you guys still want to see me try to do some legacy challenges and stuff like that, let me know in the comments down below. But I thought for my first video I'd do something a little easy, and I settled on a Kaz video where I make the original three members of Hani Yori Uta. Oh god, you can see my Skype stuff popping up. I'm sorry about that. I am such a professional YouTuber. Anyway, um, so I decided to make Chihaya, Yukiho, and Hibiki, and as you can see, I started with Chihaya, because, you know, she's the center, and I cosplay her, and, um, so I, uh, I... I took out all of the mods that I have because I felt a little bad using mods and putting this up on the gallery. Yeah, these are on the gallery, by the way. Uh, my screen name on there is Tsuki no Kage, one word, uh, if you want to download them and use them in your game. But I felt a little weird using mods because I don't remember where I got half of my mods and I felt like I wouldn't be able to link to them and putting them up in the gallery. They'd be missing a lot of stuff if people download them. I mean, the, the facial structure and all that would be there, but... So, uh, I don't know why, but it kept changing Chihaya's hair back to that short hair that I used for Yukio. But, uh... So... Let me go into a little bit about my love for The Sims. I, I've been playing since Sims 1. I know. That's not a good thing. <laughs> well, I mean, it can be. I, I have no life. This this is how I have fun. So, uh, and I've played everything up until 4. I don't have a lot of the expansions for 4. I have Get to Work, I have uh, City Living, and I have Cats and Dogs. And then out of the stuff packs, I have Parenthood, um, the Toddler Stuff Pack, uh, the, the Free Christmas Thing, Dine Out, and there's one more that I have that I can't think of what it is off the top of my head. Um, but for the most part, those are all that I have. I'm eventually going to get more and try to use more because I definitely want a lot of the stuff that I've seen in the other packs for building, um, especially the uh, stuff from Get Together, which has a lot of the Tudor stuff because I'm obsessed with Tudor houses. But for the most part, I, uh, I just wanted to stick with the regular, with, I just wanted to stay without mods for now, because for the sheer fact that I can't guarantee I'll be able to tell you where I got them. If you guys want to start seeing some Kaz videos with mods, uh, let me know and I might put them back in when I do stuff like this. But for now, I just kind of pulled them out and put them someplace else until I was done. Yeah, I ended up realizing that I forgot to do Chihaya's traits, so I went back and and did those. Uh, I tried I tried very hard not to make them all music lovers or, or want the music career, but uh, it kind of ended up with Chihai and Yukiho both wanting the music career. I, I kind of wanted to go back and download the uh, custom Shy trait, but I ended up not, and I ended up just making Yukiho kind of, kind of, uh, she really likes music and all that. Chihai is a perfectionist and, and a loner because, you know, Chihai doesn't really like to talk to people and like but uh and then I had a hard time with with Yukiho's formal just for the sheer fact that I didn't really have anything that I liked for her and I ended up going with that ruffly dress but I feel like it's a little too iori for for Yukiho um I will eventually go and make the rest of the members of 765 but I wanted to start with Haniyori Yuta and you guys can let me know in the comments who you want to see me make next for their faces, I tried not to go to anime-esque because I felt like the huge anime eyes on these Sims models looks really weird. So uh, I ended up basing their faces off of their voice actresses, actually. And uh, I made them all young, young adults, and I really should have made them teenagers, but you could always go in and fix that. Um, I will make the producer, I will make uh, Kotori, and I will make... Um, what I can of the president, <laughs> probably based off his voice actor. And uh, maybe I'll go and make Jupiter and some of the other characters from like Cinderella Girls and stuff like that. And if there's other anime or video games that you'd like to see me make characters from, let me know because I'm more than willing to make them. 
Um, I can just see Izumi in the comments now. Do Final Fantasy 15! Noctis's outfit is in the game now! Yeah, I'm aware of this and I'm probably not going to do it for a long time just to spite her. I love you, Izumi. But, uh, Hibiki was hard, because, like, there's a couple ponytails, but there's only, like, two of the high ponytails, one of them without bangs, and then this one, which has the bangs, but it still looks a little weird because it's not as full as Hibiki's outfit. And, uh, of course I went for the sporty kind of shorts and tank top look and kind of, kind of tomboy but I still gave her that kind of curly look for her formal, which was really, really hard to decide on, but, uh, I honestly really like the way Hibiki came out. I did eventually realize that I forgot to do Yukiho's makeup and I go back and I do it uh, after I do Hibiki's. And uh, I kept Chihaya and Yukiho's makeup for this, but I also ended up forgetting that Ch Hibiki wears those giant hoop earrings that I absolutely hate because they're just so huge and like... I, I, I don't wear earrings because I'm allergic to silver and a lot of earrings don't have uh, gold backing or, or anything but silver backing. So, I, uh, I don't quite understand the, the fascination with those giant hoop earrings and why people wear them. But, uh, I ended up giving Hibiki the bikini and, and kept it a simple one piece for Chihaya and Yukiho because I felt that bikinis didn't really suit them. Even though Chihaya has that bikini with the coat that she wears in uh, Idol Master 2. Um, I also tried to be a little out there with Hibiki's makeup because she seems like the person that would do stuff like that and have way too much fun with her eyeshadow. I, I made her want to be friends with everybody because it seems like Hibiki and if I could I would have given her both the loves dogs and cat and loves cat traits but I felt like that would kind of leave her unopened for the rest of them and then you can see Yuki has makeup here. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you can download them in the gallery under Skeena Kage. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video and want to see more, click that box on the left to check out Tea Time, the creepypasta I wrote for Last Pasta Ween. If you want something a little different, click that box on the right to check out the latest Let's Voice Act episode. Mata